Hi guys, so as always, I start with freshly washed and conditioned hair. My hair is actually damp. I, I let it dry for a couple hours before I started. And in order to moisturize my hair, I'm going to do the lock method. So that means I'm going to put in my leave-in conditioner of choice, which you see me doing here, working it through the ends. Next, I'm going to be using an oil. And lastly, I'm going to seal it with a cream, which is actually going to be the gel. The oil that I'm using is actually coconut oil that you could find in beauty supply stores. Um, if you choose to use the original form of coconut oil or the pure form of coconut oil, you could do that as well, but I'm using this version here and just working it through each section to lock the leave-in conditioner into my hair. As you can see, I'm actually shingling the gel through the hair, which means I'm kind of raking um, my fingers that have the gel on it through the hair to make sure that the hair becomes a bit more defined. And after I do that, I'm going to go ahead and put my twists in. I actually like to switch it up. I like to do two strand twists and then also two strand flat twists because it gives me different uh, types of curl patterns throughout the hair and creates different textures. This way when my hair, as the week is going by and the hair is getting a little bit frizzy, um, it's still manageable and it still has a lot of curl definition to it and I could extend the length of time that I could rock my twist out. So that's pretty much it. I just repeat this process all over my head. I do the lock method into each section. I put my leave-in conditioner first. I seal it with my oil of choice. And then lastly, I put my cream, which is going to be the gel um, last. Then I put two strand twists and flat twists into the section and that's pretty much it. Here is what my hair looks like after I'm finished with the whole entire process of doing my two strand twists and my two strand twi flat twists 
And now I am ready to go to sleep. But first I'm gonna put a satin um, headscarf on and then go to sleep. Hi everybody, here are the results of my shingled two strand twist. Um, I am absolutely positively loving these results. Um, it's very defined, the curls, curls are popping and I'm even getting like an angle cut kind of uh, style going on which is absolutely natural because I don't even have any type of haircut um, or style cut into my hair. So I just absolutely love it. One thing I will say is um, this morning when I woke up and I unraveled the twists, some of the twists were still dry. Uh, some of the twists were still wet or damp, um, especially because of the gel that I put on my damp hair. Didn't really fully dry, but I still wanted to take it out because I knew that even if I took it out in that state, um, it, I would still get a lot of definition. My, girl, my curls would still pop and um, I'd still be able to rock it. Um, I would say that if you let the hair fully dry and then unravel the two strand twists, you may be able to hold on to it for a few more, a few more days. Um, especially um, for me personally, I am in a situation where outside this week is going to be pretty rainy. And so when you really want to hold on to a uh, two strand twist or a set, any type of, type of twist out or braid out, um, I would recommend starting with um, dry hair that's already stretched and then putting some type of gel product over it to set the curls, let that fully dry all the way and then you usually can hold on to your two strand twist or braid out or whatever type of set style you have for a longer period of time. I didn't do that. I'm perfectly okay with it. I'll probably show you what it looks like when I actually um, dry the hair first and then unravel the two strand twist. But um, these are my results and I'm absolutely positively happy with them um, and I hope you give this method a try. It's just, you know, trial and error and I just wanted to come in here and show you guys what it looked like. Um, it's actually the end of the day, the work day, so um, this, this style held up even through the humidity and through, you know, the rainy type of weather outside. Um, it's still on and popping. Towards the end of the week, what I think I'll do when it starts to frizz out is I'll probably uh, put my infamous two strand twists into my hair um, and just rock that for the next few days or until I'm ready to um, take that out. But yes, I just wanted to show you guys what this hairstyle looks like. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, stay blessed and know that you're beautiful. Oh!